So this is my review of the Barclays Homeowner app and you can filter it so you can change the price range that you're looking for, what type of house, how many bedrooms, so that's really, really useful. Pictures, prices, floor plans, how to get in touch with the agent. It's a one-stop shop where I don't have to open different windows to look for different things. The feature that you can add the notes to and also star properties so that it saves in the app. That's a nice feature that I haven't seen on other apps that are similar uh, to the Barclays Homeowner app. Other functions that I really like are the ratings. You can rate properties that you like. Once I'd put all that information in, it would tell you here what your mortgage payments would be. Um, and then a rough idea of what you're left over with at the end of the month. So that's really, really useful. And in one case, it said that I didn't have enough. I didn't meet the requirements. So it gave me the option to find a mortgage specialist. Otherwise, it gives me numbers that I can borrow. So it gives me a really good idea on how viable it is. We did use the Barclays Homeowner app while we were on the go. Um, we found it really useful that, to ha that it was built in to find your location. Perhaps make it a little bit easier to navigate. I didn't necessarily see this button with the arrow straight away. I was looking for something up here um, to be able to let me filter. I'd like to see that it have some uh, include some previous sales data. That would be an improvement uh, of the Barclays Homeowner app for me. The map function doesn't have a satellite view, which I think would be really helpful for some people. But other than that, it's a really useful app and um, something we'll definitely continue to use.